I probably wouldn't find it that fun if I had to do like as much as my mum does. And what is the least he can weigh? So if 64 is there, 63 is there. Would you rather never eat crisps again or never eat chocolate again? Brush my brows up with this. Hey guys, it's Rosie and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am doing my night before school routine. But before we get on with this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos just like this one and stay tuned all the way to the end because throughout this video, I will be answering some would you rather questions that you guys have actually asked me. Anyways, let's get on with the routine. So it's Sunday today, which means tomorrow is Monday and usually on Sunday, I'm quite busy, which I have been today so I need to literally get everything done as in like iron my uniform get my uniform done um, get it set out I need to pack my bag literally do everything and I'm going to take you guys with me so let's go so this is our little ironing space and it's quite funny like every family has like a space that they iron in um, but I do need to iron my shirt so I've got that here My mum taught me to iron when I was little because I used to like watch my mum do it because I, I actually really like ironing. I find it quite fun. I probably wouldn't find it that fun if I had to do like as much as my mum does. I do find it fun, but luckily I only have to do my uniform so it's not too much. And when I was younger, I used to always ask my mum if I could iron and she would always go like, no, you need to wait till you're older. Because I was only like five. That wouldn't go very well. This is my uniform cupboard in here. I think I've told some of you on like a live about this. But I have a wardrobe for my uniform. It is very messy, so we're not gonna show you that. <laughs> what I like to do is I like to hang my uniform on my radiator the night before. So when I wake up, then it is lovely and warm. I'm also gonna put my tights on here, which are actually in here. And I like to put these on here. And then in the morning, because in England, in the morning it's freezing and I get like straight out of a shower, I put this on and it's lovely and warm, so I'm not cold. Okay, so I need to pack my bag now and this is just my juicy bag. It was actually my mum's and my bag broke, so she's gave me this to use, which is really nice. I need to put my EpiPen in there because I did actually go to a party last night and I brought that with me. I need to put it back in there. Um, but tomorrow I also I have business studies, which is, this is my business book. My books are literally ruined because my water leaked. And then I've got my history book. This is a new history book. And we're learning about medieval medicine and health. It's actually so fun, but it's quite gruesome though. Then I also have maths and English, but my English teacher has my book, so I don't need to pack that. Um, but I do need to finish off a bit of maths homework. And just please, just can we just look how ruined my maths book is? You can tell I don't really like maths. <laughs> but I do do a lot of work, so it's fine. It makes up for it. Okay, we are in my office now. Well, mine and my mum's office. And... Basically, this is where we do all of our like YouTube stuff, editing, homework, just all bits and bobs like that. And I do need to go on to Hegarty Maths. Hegarty Maths is basically just a, an app or a, like a thing, a website, where you can do maths homework. And this is what my teacher sets me. Um, yeah, so I now need to log in. At the moment, we're doing upper and lower bounds. And what is the least he can weigh? So if 64 is there, 63 is there, 65 is there, so 63.5 kg. Let's see if that's right. 63.5. Yay! Mum has got me a sausage roll whilst I'm doing my homework, which is really lovely of her. It's my favourite sausage roll. It's from Greg's, which is literally the best place ever. Look, when you get it right, it goes ding. It's great. As it is a Sunday, and I've literally been working all week and had a very busy week, you guys know how busy I am. Sundays are always the perfect time for a nice warm bath. And luckily I have a bath in my bathroom, so I'm gonna get in one. So 
I'm in the bath now and I normally do go on my phone and listen to some music but as I promised you um, I'm going to do some would you rather questions that you guys have actually asked me so let's do that I'm just going to stop on a random one get a dog or get a hamster I would 100% I'd rather get a dog because dogs are just amazing if I grow out of my allergies I'll get a dog hopefully soon um, would you rather never eat crisps again or never eat chocolate again? That is a super hard question for me because in my family we really like salty foods as in like or like savoury food like crisps, like hummus, bread and stuff like that and like carbs but then I also really really like chocolate but I think I'm gonna have to go for never eat chocolate again because I like like crisps more than chocolate so would you rather marry for money or love? That's such a silly question. I'd marry for love. I don't actually care about money at all. It doesn't mean anything to me. Um, except for you can buy food with it. Um, uh, right, I'm literally just scrolling and stopping. Would you rather um, be too hot or too cold? I'd rather be too hot. I cannot be too cold because I'm literally allergic to the cold. It's so strange. I swell up and everything. Would you rather go to a boarding school or a private school where you can go home at night? Um, I think a private school where you can go home at night because boarding school, I get very homesick. Like I like to spend time in my room. So I feel like a boarding school wouldn't be very good for me, but it might be good for other people. Let's do like one more question. Let's do one more question. Would you rather have false nails or false lashes? I think false nails because I don't have very good nails. I bite my nails and my lashes are quite long anyway, so I don't really need any lashes. So I think false nails. So I've never actually used this at the moment, but it's saying it will give me brighter skin. So I'm going to try it and it is a clear and bright jelly cleanser. So I've just got out of the bath and I need to moisturise because I do have very dry skin and in that little pack that I showed you which I got for Christmas it has a body butter in it and this is from Dirty Works if you guys would want to know and it smells really nice it's made out of shea and cocoa butter. On a Sunday, I just love getting all ready for a Monday. It is such a nice feeling. Waking up Monday and being all prepared and all fresh is just like the best feeling ever. It has been so long since I've literally just sat down in my hoodie. I haven't worn this hoodie for ages. It's so, so comfortable and I love it so much. But anyways, I'm chilling. I went to a party last night, so I'm checking that everybody is okay. I'm also texting Amy Charlize because we are super excited to go Top Fest together. And we're gonna sort something out on the Sunday to do, like I'm gonna go out with her or something like that. Time to do a TikTok, guys. So I literally just do TikToks all around my room. Cool. Okay, right, I'm at my vanity and it is time for some skincare. So once again, I am using Florence by Mills, um, but I'm using this toner, which I don't think I've showed you guys, but this is the Spotlight Toner Series, episode four. Um, and literally all you need to do is get a cotton pad, which I have here and put a bit of the toner on it and this literally just rejuvenates your face and your skin but I do not have any makeup on today but I still need to wipe my face over anyways once I've done the toner here I also love the bottle it's super easy to open um, I like to use two different moisturizers one is this one which is the dermatology one Cetraban 
Cetra Ben, however you want to say it, and the Florence one, which is just this. So I'm going to put a bit of this on, only a little bit. And then after that, I use the Florence by Mills one, and this works really good as a primer um, for your makeup as well. Which is very nice. And then, something that I actually like just got is this, and it's clear mascara. Um, so I'm going to show you this, and it's from e.l.f. Clear brow and lash mascara. Literally, it's just mascara, but clear. So literally, it just lifts up my lashes a bit, but then it's clear, so I can sleep with it and everything. This is for people with like really long lashes, I think. Also, it's quite good for your lashes. This is from e.l.f., by the way. And then, I also use the brow gel, which is on the other side. And I just brush my brows up with this. Making them nice and straight. And then, one last thing what I like to do is I like to use the Dior Face and Body Glow, which is this. If you can see it, it says Dior on the front. And I just put that here on my nose and on my cheekbones like this. And then I get my beauty blender and I just dab that in. And that just gives me a little bit of life into my face. And then I can do TikToks tonight. I can also sleep in this because this is it's literally just a moisturizer, basically. There's how I look. Time to tidy my vanity, guys. And all my Florence by Mill stuff goes in this little bag here. It's literally just this. This here is what I use for my tripod to set that up, and it's basically an on-the-go blender. I need to charge it. Goes in there. Clips. I think these are my mum's, so there you go, mum. Guys, check this out. So this is so pretty. My nan gave it to me, and this is my great nan's little, um, what's it called, like a trinket box? Or like something that you keep like earrings in. So I've just got my earrings in here. These are, once again, my mum's, but I use them a lot. <laughs> and then I put that there. Even though it doesn't go with the theme of my room. Well, it actually does, because I've got like champagne. So I keep it there, because it means a lot. Very special. Well then, it is time to chill. Okay, so that is the end of my night routine before school and I really hope you guys liked it because this was literally my full night routine. But if you did like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos just like this one. I love you all guys and I'll see you next time. Bye!